Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. We've got all of DadSec dumpster diving through that Galilei intercept. Anything good? Metric a shit tons of good. <laughs> I've already picked out a serious opportunity for us. Turns out Congressman Thrust's re-election campaign is getting logistical support from Invite. That's weird. And illegal. Right? Why not just give them money? Well, Invite's got years of collected data. I mean, that shit's worth way more than money. But why back a doofus like Thrust? Dude couldn't tell his ass if someone fucking handed it to him. Well, uh, let's mess him up, break some windows, see what he does. Yeah, create a reaction, might flush him out. Let's announce this. Marcus, you think you can, uh, bitch slap him for us? Uh, yeah, I got something for him. I'm gonna go fuck up that big-ass billboard with his dumb face all over it. <laughs> Send a clear message. And I'm gonna hit up his campaign funding. And I am going to... Fuck up his social media, and I am going to fuck up his website, and I am gonna fuck up his online ads. I'm gonna go for another beer. Your freedoms can only be protected if democracy thrives. But corporate interests are rigging the elections. Your elections. Jeez. Your favorite social media giant, Invite, knows everything about you. And they're manipulating your feed to tailor your opinion to their interests. They are fooling you into voting for their puppet, Congressman Mark Thrust. Invite wields the single most powerful population control tool ever created. Defend democracy. Help us tear down Info. Lend us your processing power by downloading our app and together we will expose Congressman Thrust. Join us. We are dead set. And welcome back to more of Watch Dogs 2. This is Hill, and we are already in this mission. We are working on power to the sheeple. And as you can see, Marcus's appearance has changed even further. After experimenting with the dark arts, he now has the powers of the Shuffler. Driven mad by the death of his colleague Horatio, he is about to exact vengeance as you have never seen before. Let's go. up here. Look, bro, take that shit somewhere else. Looks like we're heading here and oh, there's a fast travel right across the street it looks like. And here we are. So, I don't know if you guys are familiar with this shuffler outfit, but it imbues the wearer with supernatural power. I'm not sure we will get to showcase it in this particular mission, but rest assured you will see the fury of Marcus Holloway. All right, anyhow, let's see how the heck, here's how the heck, we need this crane. And where is Mark? 
this? Knowing me, I'll probably bring the crane right down on top of his head. <laughs> okay, I still don't see him on the street. Oh, there he is. He's... Oh, oh, oh no. Uh-uh. over here on the sidewalk. All right. Whoop, wrong button. Down, down. There we go. All right, now let's get up on board. Here we go. please and let's move across to the billboard I've seen several other people do this mission and you know, nobody seems to get over here gracefully but look I think we might have actually done it yeah. All right. Because usually this thing ends up uh, banging into these, um, I don't know if you want to call them pipes, whatever. You there? Vents. I'm looking right at a giant congressman thrust up on the billboard. Do your thing, man. Here goes. All right. Well, I guess we have to use our RC jumper to go through this conveniently um, highlighted hole in the wall or fence. Let's go back here and hack this. All right, now we can just open the door. Now, couldn't Marcus have just crawled underneath this himself? Just something to think about, people. That's all. That's all I got to say. Think about it. I think this game, you know, goes out of its way to, to sometimes make this stuff just a little bit ridiculous. All right. Add graffiti. Can, can you guys see the sign here? Mark Thrust. Okay, here we go. Nothing like adding turds to a sign to deface it. I mean, that's like the worst thing I guess you could possibly do. Add, add turds on somebody's billboard. Okay. Um, I guess I can get down now. Oh, wait, no. Here's, here's He'll know something. we're after him now. Way to go. I've got a whole team of DedSec members out working on Thrust's other signs. Nice. Meanwhile, I put together a payload to deploy an invite server. Meet me outside invite and I'll fill you in. Sure, see you. All right, meet Zatara near invite. Now see, th this was really quick. All right, let's go down here. Well, actually, you know what? We don't need to do all that. We can just fast travel. Let's bring up our map. No need for climbing. Is this it here? I think so. All right, so we will... Which is closer? We'll just go here to the pawn shop. Somebody's got some money. Sorry, ma'am. Um, is there anything else out here besides these trucks? Really? Okay, now let me see here. Let me zoom in a bit. Stand back. 
Some of you just get slapped. Yep, yes, way. I'm taking this. Uh oh, they're calling the police. 911, please state your emergency. Tell the cops to hurry! DTOS verified your location. Police are on the way. Alright, and we are here at our location. Oh no, the cops are. You know what? Let's just hit this real quick. Bye, cops. See, they don't exist in this world. Nice work on the billboard. We wanted a reaction, we got a reaction. Yeah? We got an email between Thrust and his cronies. He's seriously pissed. He's trying to pass a law against groups with the capability of revealing proprietary directives and actions. That's us. It sure sounds like something Invite would want. It's part of the reason why they're helping Thrust. Mm-hmm. You need to hack into the CEO's office. Oh, Mary Catskill. And here's an exploit to open up the back door into the servers. Has anybody ever seen a USB drive Another that big? USB? I, I could start a damn store with these. Just don't sell that one. <laughs> All right, let's head on over. You know, last time I was in here, things didn't go so well. Worst time ever, really. Yeah. Bad memories. They've increased security because of that, by the way. Oh, of course they have. Well, that's just great news. I'm like, now that's a fucked up language. Suck, but no wonder it's loud. Even the Romans spoke Greek. Anyway, the first word and the last word. Just how increased is this? Doesn't seem that increased. You know what? Never mind. Forget I asked. Let's go drink or something. Can I just walk in here? Somebody's coming this way. Come on, Marcus. Where is the guy? Oh, he's not on this floor? Okay. Mm-mm. to me. Oh no, I didn't mean to do that. guy, I think he's standing right up there looking. Oh, let's see what those bones. Cracking. Let's 
past this here. Oh. Thought this was okay, something to pick up, no. gotten the hard part first. But you know what this means, people. It's puzzle time. Alright, let's see if we can't figure this out. Got it. All right, now I need to tap the CEO's phone. And a man. Okay, what's up with this? You seeing what I'm seeing? Looks like shit. They're using bellwether. That means Bloom is behind all of this. Oh man, they're manipulating people into voting for Thrust. You know what? Should be easy to refactor this to push against Thrust. Ah, that's genius. Do it. Don't forget to tap the CEO's phone. Headed there now. people to death with dark magic. Alright, I think the only way we can get through is out here in the open. Hack, hack. I ain't sticking around. Give it up. Oh, Clear, he is too on. damn slow. Really? Code three. Proceed to a long location. Oh, he did it. Phone tapped. We'll record all her conversations. We'll get everything she says. Now get the hell out of there. Easier said than done. I'm out of here. I ain't sticking around. But they didn't have the 
project's best interest. What the fuck you want, Holmes? Uh -huh. you know, What do you know? I think I did it. Wait for it. Here we go. Okay, I'm out. Josh is working on changing the invite algorithm to screw thrusts. Hey, one of the other candidates is having a campaign rally out in front of City Hall. I might just meet you there. Cool. <laughs> All right, let's see where that is located. Not far. All right, let's go there. We are almost at the end of the game, so I'm going to go ahead and continue, at least with this one part here. I think there are only a couple more missions left. It's been a long journey. Start the mission. And the big data companies are geniuses at separating you from your data. Yo, Teresa Moretti seems to have a shot. If Invite gets its way, no election is safe. Bellwether has the power to influence every voter in the whole damn country. And Thrust is gonna be the guy covering for him. That's why he's so important. Well, ever since we messed with Invite's code, Congressman Thrust has taken a hit in the polls. Invite is freaking out. Yo, Em, you gotta hear what we recorded, all right? <laughs> this is Thrust talking to Mary Catskill, Invite's CEO. Can't you do something? It's all going wrong. Let's meet in person. I have something that will square this away. Oh, thank goodness. Uh, let's meet at my penthouse. Up the security, and I'll see you there. Thanks so much, Mary. Keep it all on the I'll go record what's happening. We'll use it against him. And I will help you out. Your carriage awaits, sir. Why, thank you, sir. Hmm. Yeah, it's like you can't make this game dark if you try. <laughs> I, was like, I would love to make this a more serious tone like the first Watch Dogs, because to me, that was better than this one, even though, you know, there's a huge debate about that. Which was better, Watch Dogs, Something tells Watch me security is going to be crazy. I did some research. Whole place has security cams. We can use those to find out what's up. Security cams to break their security. You know it. The vote's one of the few things people got left. You know invites tracking everybody's voting patterns. Of course. Why wouldn't they? This invite thing drives me nuts. I mean... Companies manipulate people all the time, but they're so fucking insidious. They control all the traffic. They know everything about everybody and how to take advantage of them. Well, these things should really get you upset, the fact that we're being manipulated and controlled. And this is happening in real life. This isn't that far from, from the truth.
All right, well, we are going to conclude this part of Power to the Sheeple. And we will continue in our next episode. This is Hill, and I'm out. <laughs>